Hello YouTube, this is Bowtide Media, and today I have a pretty different video. As you can tell by the title and what you're actually watching, this is me reacting to my Spotify wrapped at the end of the year. Uh, I pretty much exclusively, I do exclusively use Spotify for all my listening stuff, and so uh, I love going through it as a statistical lover myself. I love going through all the data and stats for the year and seeing what I kind of have and uh, how things have changed year to year. And so, um, yeah, let's get into my wrapped. Uh, I'm super excited to see what this is. And um, you may not be, yeah, if you're new to this channel and or, uh, or like, why am I watching someone else's wrapped? I think it's interesting to kind of see, especially if you uh, are around the channel for some time to see kind of what my musical tastes are and what I enjoy um, and kind of see how that plays into all my different um, rankings and stuff like that. Uh, so this is a pretty informal video, but we're just going to uh, go ahead, hit this, uh, see what you listen to, and kind of go through it and see uh, what it is. If I, okay, if I'm going to guess my top five songs, though, uh, my guess um, in order, if I'm going to guess in actual order, number one is Run the Jewels' Holy Kalama Fuck. Uh, two would be Joji's uh, Give Me Love. Three, um, oh shoot, what was the song that I... Uh, I cannot remember. Oh, uh, Eden's Rushing, I think, is three. Four, I actually think, is Joji's Run. Um, and five is Ellis's Speak Francais. Um, that's my guess for what my top five is. Uh, but we'll actually see and see what my whole thing is. So let's get into it. Uh, what I listen to this here. The longest year may not be over yet. But your wrapped finally is. Of course it is. Boom, boo, doo, ding. Let's start off with a win. 190? 190 what? You discovered 190 new artists this year. Even in 2020, you still found ways to grow. I feel like that's not actually a ton of new artists. Um, genre lust. Who says you have to go outside to explore? You listen to 359 genres this year, including 88 new ones, I think. Top genres were... Where is EDM? EDM, pop, gaming EDM, rap, and vapor twitch? What the hell is vapor twitch? All songs I got through it. There's Holy Kalama Fuck. Top song in here. Okay, I got that right. Number one, Holy Kalama Fuck. Run the Jewels. Solid song. The story of your 2020. <laughs> Just playing the song again. First stream, June 8th. I think this came, that was after. Day with the most streams is August 13th. That was probably the day I was writing the review for it. My 50th stream. <laughs> I listened to it 50 times. To 90, only 93 times in a year. But a year will 20. There's uh, Run. Top song, Holy Front. Run. Rushing. Give me love. Oh, that was relatively close. I'm going to keep it on here for a second. That was relatively close. My one holy clam fuck to K2 was wrong, so I, I mixed up uh, Gimme Love and Run. That was, That's kind of impressive, though. And then three was Rushing, I got that correctly, and five was Good Morning by Eden, not uh, Alice Speaker on site. If that is six, if Speaker on site is six, I will, that's actually really impressive to get that, but that's pretty close to what I expected, actually. Okay, we'll go do the playlist after, and we'll see my top 100 after. Um, but for now, we're going to keep going and see what the rest of this is. Let's see. You're a taste maker. So I, I, listen, I listen to a lot of worship music too. So not a lot. 11 of your plays gained 34 new followers. Please influence responsibly. If you want to check out my uh, Spotify playlist, you can go to Dakota Huber is my name on Spotify and find me. Dakota with a D. D-A-K-O-D-A-H-U-B-E-R. And you can find all my playlists so I can gain this number for ne higher next year. Um, we're not loading this. So we're just going to quickly just do this and go on to data. Because why not? I actually don't use a ton of data ever on Spotify, so throwback. Um, some old favorites. Compared to other listens, what decade did you listen to the most? 2000, 1990, 1980, 1970s. It's got to be 2000s. I don't listen to a ton of older music. You got it. Yeah. I don't listen to, like, super old music. It's pretty much... Oh. God. <laughs> Top song from this... T really? I guess I did listen to a decent amount of Guiding Light. Who was by your side other than your houseplants? Guess the top artist. Okay, this is really tough. So Eden came out the whole new album, and Eden's my number one artist of all time, I would say. Um, can I just let this play or will it? I'll, I'll pause it. 
Okay, here's my thing. Eden was my is my number one favorite artist of all time, other than Daft Punk. Uh, Run the Jewels is incredible. I just listened to them for the first time this year, and their stuff is phenomenal. I've played through their album a ton. Eden's album, though, I didn't I didn't love. Like I, I liked his last one a lot better. Uh, Joji, I listened to a crap ton of Joji. Madion, I don't think it's Madion, but I listened to a lot of Madion. Uh, if I had to guess, I think I listen to more Eden on a regular basis, just overall across the year. So I'm gonna go ahead and say it's Eden. If not, okay, good. Russian. You're in the top top point one percent of listeners this year, which doesn't surprise me. Your favorite song was Rushing, and you spent four thousand minutes listening to Eden this year. Listen to sixteen thirty artists this year. I feel like that's a lot. I, I feel like I personally listen to not a ton of variety, but that's a lot. picture so clear, fading. Oh, Madam was ahead of Run the Jewels. That's interesting. And then San Holo was five. That makes a lot of sense. Um, wow, I'm surprised Madam's that high actually. Uh, I hope my audio actually records for this. Thanks for spending all of sixty. Wait, what? Okay, I think that's it. Only 80,000 listens. So the reason I think I only have 80,000 listens in a regular, uh, or 80,000 hours of 80,000 minutes, um, I actually listen to a lot of my music offline on Spotify because I don't, I only recently started using data for Spotify. Um, so a lot of that is spent uh, driving and uh, where I just have my phone on me and it's my, it's offline. So um, I think that number is actually significantly higher than it should be. Uh, but let's go to that playlist. Uh, this is my playlist here. Add it to my library. Okay, so let's go to my top tw 2020. Uh, holy Kalamafuck, Run, Rushing, Give Me Love, Good Morning. So these are the top. I'm, my guess is number six is um, Speak Francais. I would, okay, it's Honest by San Holo featuring Broods. That's, that's a, yeah, I listened to that one quite a bit too. Uh, New Magic One, Tyler the Creator. I never stay in love, Steven. Isa Heel, Eden, Gold by Coven, yep. Don't say you're sorry. Oh, that's higher than Speak Francais. Um, Hell of a Night, Steven, Hurts, Eden, Ya Ya, Eminem, Friends, Roman Silver. There is Speak Francais with Ellis. Uh, Projector by Eden, Delilah by Steven, Godzilla by Eminem, Point the Pin by Run the Jewels, FOMO by Eden, On Track by Tim Impala, Miso Memories by Just a Gent. Uh, Chasing Clouds by Bad Computer, Love, Death, Distraction by Eden, Just by Run the Jewels, Get Your Wish, Porter Robinson, Borderline by Tame Impala, 2020 Eden. There's a lot more Eden than I expected there to be, actually. I, I, I mean, I felt like I... So I didn't love this album. Or sorry, I loved this album. <laughs> I Compared to his last one, um, I thought it was... I, I loved Vertigo a lot more than this one. Um, and so I think... I think ultimately I just felt like I listened to it less, but I clearly listened to it a ton. Miso Memories, Chasing Clouds, I already go through that. Um, 2020 Goonies vs. EP, Surely You Know, What a World, How to Sleep, Identity by Robotaki, Love Potion, Sharma Sabi, Sanctuaries all the way down here, Streams, Let Me Get Me, that one surprises me a little bit actually. Um, Start Again by Muzz, Graves into Gardens, Elevation Worship, uh, So Far So Good, Toxic, Instant Destiny, Marble Tea, Calm Down, Dream Dream Dream, Modern Loneliness, Hey Ma, Just Saying, Caught in the Rays, Distraction, Big Love, Untitled, Posthumous Forgiveness, Vulnerable, You Were Good to Me, Question Mark, Warriors, It Might Be Time, Violence, Tides, Ubi, Something Comforty, Hurricane, Walk in the Snow, All for Nothing, Wishes, uh, Miss Being Happy, Where Does the Time Go, I Found You, Out of Sight, The Small Things, Blinding Lights, The Difference, All Night, Brand New Phone, Would You, Daylight, Breathe Deeper, A Better Place, or A Sweeter Place, Conifer, Tomorrow, Forever Over, Into the Sun, Free, Don't Start Now, Boomerang, All My Friends, Lost in Yesterday, Physical, Nam, Gorgeous, Remix by, um, Memba, After Hours, Don't Bring Me Down, Miracle, Hold Me Just Because, Fighters, Good Thing, Grant Remix, and Hello. The number one thing I actually think is interesting here is that Constellations is not on here. Constellations is my favorite song of all time. Forever Over eh, Forever Over and Constellations are kind of go back and forth, but Forever Over is here, but Constellations is not, and Constellations has always been in my rap, so this is, I think, the first year it hasn't. Uh, Wishes is here, um, which, I mean, is also a fantastic song. Um... But yeah, that was me reacting to my uh, Spotify wrapped. Let me know if you think anything was super interesting, super weird, if you like a lot of the stuff that I like, uh, and kind of look into who I am as a person and who I am as a, a listener, a, a consumer of music. But I uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in another video.